the uh, aims and scope of virus evolution abroad. We're interested in uh, all studies that consider both viruses, um, their um, genetics and biology, and, and all forms of ecological and evolutionary processes. Of course, for many viruses, both the ecological and evolutionary processes occur together and are in a sense inseparable. So we would consider both this a, a journal about virus ecology as well as a journal about virus evolution. With this new journal, Virus Evolution, uh, what we aim is to, uh, to be the forum, to be the, the, the place where all people really interested in the field of, of uh, how viruses evolve uh, will uh, meet and they will share their findings and they will learn from each other. So as I say, this is a multidisciplinary field, so we need a place where, not, where people coming from different fields can find uh, comfortable, they can really share their ideas and not being restricted by uh, the classic view of virologists publishing in virus journals, evolutionary biologists publishing in evolutionary journals, and then physicists and mathematicians publishing whatever they, they can. Okay? So we really aim to be a place where all these people together discuss and share ideas. Uh, and this is reflected in the editorial board of the journal. So we made an effort to bring people from different areas and, and to have all of them really committed to developing this journal to, to, to the top or the highest uh, possible uh, place that we can uh, dream. No? The journal Virus Evolution aims to serve the community of researchers interested in the field of uh, virus evolutionary biology. Uh, and that covers a, a wide range of disciplines. It's an interdisciplinary research field, uh, including uh, evolution biology, ecology, um, statistics, genomics, um, infectious disease, epidemiology, public health, uh, clinical medicine, uh, development of drugs and vaccines, and many other disciplines I haven't mentioned. And in, there is, a, there is a, a cohesive community of people uh, out there and we meet each other at conferences and international meetings and we're often speaking next to each other, but there isn't a, a, a single place for, for this work to be read together. And, and the, um, the interaction between evolution biologists and virologists is, is crucial because it's impossible to, to properly understand the biology of viruses and answer many of the most important practical questions, whether they be to do with developing antiviral drugs or um, uh, control of infectious disease outbreaks without using key concepts and ideas from evolutionary biology. In the same uh, way, uh, viruses provide perhaps the best model system for us to understand basic evolutionary processes. They're very simple, they have straightforward genomes that we fully understand, and the link between genotype and phenotype is much closer than for any other uh, organism. So just to illustrate some um, of, the, uh, of the topics that we hope to cover in the journal, um, we're interested in the long-term evolution of viruses, so that can include virus taxonomy, the origin of uh, viruses themselves, the evolution of virus genes and genomes, uh, paleovirology and endogenous viruses. Uh, we're interested in viruses as model systems for studying evolutionary processes, so that can include experimental evolution, uh, uh, other more theoretical problems in population genetics uh, or evolutionary theory that arise from evolutionary biology, um, problems such as lethal mutagenesis, the evolution of mutation rates and the evolution of fundamental um, uh, genetic processes such as recombination. So we very much look forward to uh, developing virus evolution uh, into a vital resource for the field. Uh, we hope to provide very high uh, editorial standards uh, and we have uh, an editorial board uh, of, of researchers um, who care very passionately about the field uh, and, uh, and wish to see it develop. It's an open access journal um, uh, which will uh, bring your research to the widest possible audience and we very much hope uh, that you will consider submitting to us and we we'll look forward to receiving and reading your papers.